physician scientists contribute to life-saving innovations, from insulin to immune-targeted therapy for cancer. If your dad has a heart attack, it is the work of physician scientists that contributed to the medicines that saved his life and improved his outcomes. Or, if your family member gets diagnosed with cancer, the work of physician scientists has and will continue to improve their survival from cancer. The work of physician scientists has helped get us the highly efficacious vaccines for COVID-19, which will be crucial for ending this pandemic. But physician scientists are endangered, making up only 1.5% of today's workforce, down from 4.5% in the 1980s. Poor funding for research is a major contributor to this decline, and the pandemic threatened them further. That means that further improvements in diseases like cancer and heart disease are threatened. We need physician scientists more than ever due to COVID-related health consequences such as long COVID and other health consequences such as dementia. Protecting the physician scientist is a matter of safeguarding your health, national security, and maintaining our competitiveness on the international front. We can save the physician scientists. We need to provide bridge funding and increased grants dedicated to physician scientists. These are examples of what physician scientists are working on and how it may save you or a loved one in the future. Dr. Sahin and Terechi, for example, they were working on an mRNA therapy that would be used to target cancer. When they realized that this technology could be leveraged to develop a COVID-19 vaccine, they pivoted their work, and thus was born the first and highly effective COVID-19 mRNA-based vaccine. My research focuses on the devastating brain tumor glioblastoma, the same tumor that killed Ted Kennedy, John McCain, and Bo Biden, among many others each year. I work on trying to prevent adverse cardiovascular outcomes associated with cancer therapy. I have had young patients who have died from cardiovascular complications, such as heart failure, due to their chemotherapy and not due to their cancer. Research in this area will help improve the outcomes of cancer patients and protect their heart through chemotherapy. You can help. Write to your representative and senator to support increased funding for physician scientists. Go to the provided link on the screen and on the bottom of the message write, Increase support for physician scientists, bridge funding, and grants. Thank you.